Hi, I'm here with Katie Bach today, and she is a compost expert, the compost queen, the dirt diva. And you know we have something in common. We love compost because mm -hmm. the three biggest gardening chores are feeding, weeding, and watering. And what do you tell people takes care of all three of those chores? Compost. Compost is great. If you go ahead and weed really well, mm -hmm. and then add one to two inches of compost to your garden, it will hold down the weeds for you. And the even better thing about compost is that it holds in the moisture, and any weeds that do come up in the compost are super easy to pull up because why compost is holding in the moisture, it's also adding nutrients into your soil, which just make your soil so healthy, your weeds just pop right out. I so love it does, that. it's amazing. It's a joy to weed when you mulch with compost. Yes, right? it that is. is the it truth. makes it so much easier. Now, what about um, getting compost? Because I see you have Cascade compost in bags right there. Yes. One thing about having a bag of compost next to you while you're working in the garden, weeding, it's so nice. You can just take a shovel full, pull it along with you. Ah. It's a great way to work through those small beds. And then you get, you're also down here and you get all these little weeds you don't always see. Whoa. And now what if you need a whole bunch of compost? Because like, I have a really big yard. Can I have a whole load delivered? Yes, absolutely. Cascade compost will deliver to you between five and however hundreds of yards you want. Oh my gosh. And when you get Cascade compost, then you should do just like when you get topsoil. Cover the pile yes, so you cover don't get it weeds. Up. Cascade compost is approved organic through the state of Washington, the WSDA program. Oh, so it's okay for, for the cats and the kids yes, and, the, it is. and everything. It is. Oh, it is. all right. And then I also love how when you're using compost, it keeps the soil soft enough, not just to pull the weeds, but to add things. Like when I'm deadheading daffodils, you know what I do? Or pansies or any flowers. Yeah. It's so easy to just dig in and bury the spent blossoms. It's called spot Excellent. composting. Great way to compost. <laughs> Our compost is made from yard and garden waste. Okay, and locally from here, landscapers. you make it locally. Yes, we make it locally okay. in Pierce County. It's um, the yard pickup um, all comes to the Pierce County site. Um, it's composted in indoors in a state-of-art facility so that all the temperatures are controlled so we're meeting all the regulations compost is heavily regulated and we have to meet the regulations for weed seed kill for the temperatures for that along with all the pesticide and herbicide oh. um, residual you know what i really like it's a covered facility so you don't have horsetail in your compost. Yes, exactly. I love that. Exactly. And that helps us keep control of the air and monitor the temperature so that we know that it's being done correctly and we're meeting all those stringent requirements. And it comes out looking like this. Beautiful, yes, beautiful. black, Dark like and rich. chocolate frosting on top of the soil. It makes your garden look good enough to eat. Whoa. Oh my gosh, Katie, I love how it turns out now that we're finished putting the compost down, it makes a yard look amazing. But there's three other reasons we use compost besides how great it looks. Hold in the moisture, keep down the weeds, and add nutrients back into the soil. So when we use compost, we have less weeding, feeding, and watering. Yes. I love compost. We all just need it. Yes, me too.